In this video, you'll learn how to perform RNA extraction from preserved saliva or swab samples using Norgen's Saliva and Swab RNA Purification Kit. Step 1. Lysate Preparation Before you begin, it's a good idea to clear the workspace and clean it with 70% ethanol. This will minimize the possibility of contaminating your samples. Transfer 250 microliters of preserved saliva into a 2 ml tube using a pipette. Add PBS until the volume of the mixture is 400 microliters. Next, add 400 microliters of Lysis Buffer A. Vortex the lysate for 10 seconds. Then add 400 microliters of 96% ethanol to the lysate. Vortex once again for 10 seconds. This procedure can also be used to isolate RNA from fresh saliva and swab samples. Step 2. RNA Binding Assemble the spin column with a 2 mil collection tube. Add 600 microliters of lysate to the spin column. Centrifuge the sample for one minute at 14,000 G. Discard the flow through into a waste container. Reassemble the spin column and collection tube. Repeat this step until all the lysate has been passed through the spin column. Step three, column washing. Add 400 microliters of solution WN to the column assembly. Then centrifuge for one minute at 14,000 G. Discard the flow through into a waste container. Reassemble the spin column and collection tube. Next, add 400 microliters of wash solution A to the column assembly. Centrifuge for one minute at 14,000 G. Discard the flow through into a waste container. Reassemble the spin column and collection tube. Repeat the wash step with wash solution A. After discarding the flow through, centrifuge the spin column for two minutes at 14,000 G to dry. Step four, RNA elution. Remove the spin column from the collection tube and place it atop a 1.7 mil elution tube. Add 50 microliters of elution solution A. Then place the elution tube with the spin column in a centrifuge. Centrifuge for two minutes at 2000 G. Then centrifuge for one minute at 14,000 G. Step five, RNA storage. RNA samples can now be stored at minus 20 degrees for short-term storage and at minus 70 degrees for long-term storage. In the next tutorial, we'll learn how to detect specific RNA sequences using Norgen's TACMAN RT-PCR kits. For more information, please visit our website, norgenbiotech.com.